Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie and this is episode 2 of season 7 of my Alpha 17 Let's Play. <laughs> I know I said I was going to start at 8, but I just couldn't wait to uh, get recording again. I'm so excited. <laughs> um, I made a big boo-boo during the night. I got bored. I didn't want to sit and just do nothing. Um, and as you can see, there's several of these uh, Mr. Chins walking around. And I knew that if I went out, I would get seen by one of them. So I decided I would do something safe and go downstairs and open up that safe. And well, <laughs> when I went down there, I started banging and uh, even when you're stealth, hitting on that uh, safe makes your noise level to 100%. Even though it is muffled a little bit, uh, but I did get it damaged a little <laughs> uh, before the zombies came in. I thought they were going to come around through the door and then in here, so I solidified this block right there uh, with my... Um, <laughs> I put in a couple of frames and then I solidified that bottom one to help once they came through. I could pew, 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 you know, punch them or whatever. And they did the worst thing and they came through the wall over here and I wasn't expecting that and they wound up getting me trapped in here because I couldn't pick this up and get out and I couldn't get out because they were standing in the doorway blocking me and they wound up killing me. So I had to stand up there doing nothing and, and wait until... Um, they at least wandered off. One of them was still aggroed on me even though I died. So I, I don't think that should be a thing, you know, but uh, he was very angry. <laughs> and he, that's where all this damage came from was that while I was sitting up there, he was just over here running around, banging on stuff. The other guy, <laughs> He de immediately and started wandering off. I watched him while I was sitting up there doing absolutely nothing. So yeah. Um, I was looking around throughout the night because I, I didn't really have anything else to do. And there are a couple of spots like maybe over in this area or in this area or yeah now that I see this during the day that doesn't look that level at all um, I'm not sure maybe even over here might be a good area for a base. Um, and I did, <laughs> since I couldn't go anywhere, I went ahead and made up some blocks uh, and got ready for the day. Uh -huh. So, what I wanted to do is I saw there's this POI over there. That might have some good uh, resources for us. Also, there's the town to go check out. Um, lots of things we could be doing. But first of all and foremost, I need closure <laughs> for my horrible night. So we're going to go take our revenge on these a-holes. Hey, Chin. Mr. Chin. Oh. Yeah, I know it was you. I know it was you. I saw you wander off and I kept I kept an eye on you. I know you were responsible for eating my guts throughout the night. <laughs> so yeah, it was these two guys. 
I'm not very pleased with them. Yeah, you guys. Not, not happy with you at all. Oh man, Mr. Chin. Oh, look at all the garbage around here. Garbage is your friend. Except for when it just has glass in it. It's no longer your friend. Oh, just the glass. Um, another thing, we we got lucky because that. Um, actually, what I want to do is let's go back to that other POI. And with the table saw and cue up some of those vents because that's going to save us tons of wood. Um, I can use those instead of wood blocks or the, the wood frames uh, in certain cases where I know that, you know, more than likely the zombies aren't going to... Uh, be coming through but I like having them uh, <coughs> I don't know what would you call it not see through like the the wood frames so let's just uh, favorite that and and I, I think that all of these are reduced Recipes, I'm not sure. Even the picket fence only takes two. Hmm. Wood frame half blocks. Let's see, all of these still take two. Uh, because they're just wood frames. Oh, I like this. The wood trellis. You can actually climb on those. Like a ladder. So you could have a ladder without it, you know, looking like a ladder. Uh, so that's kind of cool. Hmm. Nope, we're just gonna go with the fence. Let's just go with the fence. Let's make like uh, 50 of them. Yeah, and oh, those look like they're gonna go pretty fast. So maybe we'll just, uh, we'll go chop down this little tree right here while we're waiting. <laughs> and then once it's done, we're gonna go over to that POI that's really close because I think it'll have some cement and whatnot. And also I wanted to go ahead and eat and drink since I now know and I have confirmation in uh, in the in the patch notes there is overeating. I mean you can legitimately overeat. It's not wasted is what I mean by overeating so you'll go over the 100 so you can see it's going up and then it'll draw from that but you won't get penalized until it goes underneath the hundred so that is kind of cool so we could go ahead and oh it's you don't get penalized till you go below 75 I think so we could go ahead and drink another one. Yeah. That's good. That's good to know. 
Oh, I like it that it shows up that it goes over a hundred over there on on the little uh, I don't know the hood the hood over in the lower left corner. Oh, there we go. Awesome, awesome. Okay, we're gonna go run over to this guy and check it out. Oh, um, let's see if we can get, we need some wood. So let's get this stump and see if we can get some honey to boot. You know, I'm gonna try, um, there are those little uh, wood piles, like, uh, what do you call them? Um, a pallet, oh my God, my brain. So, I noticed that, um, you know, the, the bricks, they're like so worth mining, but I don't know, the, the little pallets, they seem to be, I mean, you get like one wood and it takes like five or six tries to, uh, break the pallet. So you're like, eh, what's the point? in uh, breaking the pallet for five tries just to get one bit of wood. I think it should be more. So we're gonna, oh yeah, look at all that. We're gonna go ahead and, and try the pallet one more time and see if maybe they changed it with all the other changes. We're gonna get this guy before we go in. Oh look, there's a piggy. Come on, Mr. Chin. We're gonna get that piggy too. Oh, and look, there's another building right here. I'm glad we came over here. Uh. Whoop. All right. Let's go ahead and repair that up. These guys are mean. They are really freaking mean. They get up on you. They can do some serious damage. Okay. Now, the sucky thing about this is there are going to be vultures over here. Um... I think that's one right there. Yes, it is. There's two of them. Oh, yeah. Oh, crap. I missed. There we go. That's two of them down. But I'm pretty sure there are more. Oh, it's so hard to see. Oh, I'm so scared. I hate the vultures. And they could be up on that radio tower, too. Aha! There's one. Is that... Nope, that's one, too. And here's one. Oh, I totally missed. Why am I not getting this? There we go. I think that should be all of them. But now we gotta deal with um, the guys that are in the buildings. And plus, these are like good feathers. Whew. 
I'm hoping that's all of them. I really, really freaking hate the vultures. <laughs> I don't hate them as much as the dogs, but they are definitely up there. Yeah, let's get these feathers. All right, we're going to, um, if you shoot these, they open up and hopefully don't disturb. All right, bandage. Oh, you little punk. I hate you, I hate you. You made me sick. Literally. Look, he's got my arrow. Thank you. I love it when they hold my arrow for me. It's so nice. They're such polite little zombies. Alright. Let's go see. Uh, let's open up this one right here. Oh, bird's nest. <laughs> oh, yeah. Got me some eggs. See you. We got to be careful of these landmines. Things in there. Alright. You know, it would be really cool if they would actually put, um, you know, make there at least a small chance that when you go and you open up the campfires that there might be a pot or a grill in there, you know, the ones that are in the camps like this. They wouldn't have a freaking pot here. They totally would have had a pot here. Um, let's, I guess, uh, make sure everything's clear in here. All right, I think the camp's clear. Awesome, a flashlight. Did we get any bones from those vultures? I don't think they give bones. I think they just give uh, feathers. Oh, we did. I really wish that. Um, oh, we got a we got a level. I definitely want to get the pack mule because that's so freaking annoying. Uh, but I'm going to try to bump up to level 3 in this quickly so we can get another sexual tyrannosaurus and another level to all of these. Because 
these are so useful in um, helping gather things faster. Um, I'll also go into the int, uh, better barter, and get that hammer and forge. At level 10, you can get level 10 and int 4, you can get a forge. And right now, we're level 4, so we got a little bit of work to do. Oh, check that out. Got some guns. Oh, yeah. There's usually like, oh, I feel robbed. There's usually like a backpack or something over there. Um, so yeah, if you didn't know, these little sandbags have concrete in them. It's only like, like that one only gave five, but I think if you put points into it, you can get uh, like up to 10 or something. And the blue bags have the cobblestone, so that's awesome. Um, the brown ones, uh, let's go ahead and, and harvest one just to see. I don't know if they've changed it, but it just doesn't seem like it's worth it to me to, to harvest these things. Look, you don't get anything. Look, I, I just wasted my time with that. But it looks like maybe occasionally you can get like um, an electric part or a mechanical part, but it's not all of the time. And it takes like four or five hits just to get rid of that. So, you know, it seems like a big waste of time to me. If we see a pallet, I definitely want to get... Uh, it to see if it's still worthless <laughs> and and also with like the barrels that you see I, I tried looting those as well and they seem to only give you like one or two wood And you know, I guess it's not such a big deal when you can harvest, when you can plant and harvest the wood. See, look, I get more resources out of letting them drop. I mean, how much wood do we get from like this? Got one already. only got one. Oh yeah, and I need to get some snow as well, so maybe we'll uh, we need water. Yeah, that should be enough for now. Um, also, we're in a cold biome and we don't have the um, cotton plants around, so we definitely need to harvest this stuff up. Uh, let's get six bandages. Oh, yeah. Now... Oh, here's a backpack. Sweet! Oh, it was empty. Bummer. Uh, but there was something. Yeah. There we go. We got the purse with three paper in it. Oh. Really the reason why I wanted to come over here was for all these. Um, <laughs> the sandbags and uh, stuff to get the extra that concrete. Um, these I think you can get sand out of, but it's like the other ones. You get one, you get one, and it's not, it's just not worth the time in my opinion. But these definitely are the bags. Maybe that's something they're going to be working on, uh, 
uh, adjusting like those boxes there because honestly it's not worth the time in my opinion and the pallets and the barrels because those don't seem like uh, they're worth the effort put into to mining them either I like I really like knowing that you can overeat Uh, like it's the food isn't wasted if you eat before it's time so I really like that um let's get rid of the one sand awesome so we got 133 cobblestone only 26 concrete mix but you know a uh, well placed concrete is better than no concrete so and we're down a little bit so let's go ahead and eat another one and we got enough for like two more I want to go check that out but let's go run over to the house and drop this stuff off instead of making another chest that way we don't have to make a trip just to carry everything back I can't help it. I get I have to loot the stuff. <laughs> I just can't. I can't pass it up. I don't know why. Um, I guess we could go ahead and drink too. We probably need it. Awesome. Wasn't as low as I thought, but that's okay. It wasn't wasted, so that's good. Let's throw. Whew! Got like a little chill. Throw all our stuff and things in here. Actually, let's get. Um, just throw all the stuff and things in there, and we'll get a couple of. Um, Get those two bacon and eggs going. I'm gonna need like one wood. There we go. That way they'll be ready when we come back. Um, I want to make a an upgrade, but at the same time I want to wait until at least I can make a level two. Uh, do we have a point? No, but we're getting close. So let's go ahead and make like 10 more of these guys. And um, let's see, I'll probably, instead of ending the episodes at uh, at 20 o'clock, maybe we'll do 18 o'clock. Yeah. That way that'll give me a little bit more time to uh, to do gathering because it's kind of you know boring just chopping down trees and banging on rocks. Sorry I had to take a little coffee coffee break there. Um Oh, look, here's the little bag. We don't really need these blueberries either. Oh, it had a pistol. Some ammo. Um, I think... Oh, wait, let's, let's like go ahead and... We're gonna get that guy on our hot bar. In case, um, you don't really see that many wolves around in frozen biomes thank goodness but uh on the off chance that i do because there is um there is other biomes nearby so it could happen
Yeah, I just wanna, cause even a pistol could uh, save our lives. <laughs> Not that I uh, have some streak to maintain or anything. I don't know, I think um, it's all like a learning experience. <laughs> I'm still learning. Okay, I'm trying to, oh, I don't think I've seen this type of POI before. Look, it's got a little um, work table outside that shed. Yeah, I don't think I've been in this one before. Interesting. Checking the mail, being a good neighbor. Uh huh. I wonder, can I? Can I shoot that? Oh, the grill looks like it's intact. Oh, Debbie's sad. Oh, that's a good workbench. Holy crap. We totally lucked out. All right. We'll put, um, what was it that I put it on? I think it's this one. No, let's, um, Let's look on the map. I want to make sure it's... Yeah, it was the little house. This one. Work. Inch. Oh, yeah. That's amazing. Okay, I think we could have shot that with an arrow. Hello, is anybody home? Doesn't look like it. Is, oh, no, that's a bag. There's nobody out here. Well, let's go ahead and at least uh, get this, these bags while we're out here. There's like nothing. take care of him so he doesn't sneak up and bite us in the booty. Come on, guy. Oh, yeah, give me some eggs and bacon. Smack. Yeah, so I think, uh, the next time I level, I'm going to put a point in int so I can at least make a level 2 weapon. That way, if I do make it, it's uh, a little bit of a benefit over finding it, you know, just a level 1 or something. <laughs> Alright, what's in the trash out here? Ooh. All right, let's go stealth. Oh, look at that. Boing! Most of the coolers are usually... I'm just... Yeah. I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to go ahead and scrap all of these. repair up before we go in. Right in the 
here. Oh, Jiminy. Seriously? Oh, I'm just missing. Yep. Hello. How are you doing, skater punk? Not too good, it looks like. Oh, lots of plastic on those. See? Plastic. Uh huh. I know that trick. Oh, seriously. Sometimes that button just doesn't work. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, so we got a level. Let's go ahead and buy our int. And uh, yeah, I've been waiting for this. We can do the iron reinforced club and get rid of that stupid wooden club. Oh yeah. Give us a little bit more damage. Yeah, that way if we find a mod, even if it's just a die, uh, we can, you know, make our weapon a little bit better. Oh yeah. Give me some of that cloth. I'm going to need it for bandages. Oh man. Oh, I die. All right. Um, yeah, I think we woke somebody up. Delete it, zombie. Shoo, shoo, shoo. This is under, under the stairs. Okay, shit. What is it? Why is this taking so long to break? Oh no, don't do that one. You're gonna wake the whole house up, be quiet. Yeah, stand on the trash. Stand on the trash so I can hit you. Repair that back. And we're gonna make a noise. Oh, good. Oh, this is spooky. Uh huh. Oh, man. 
Oh yeah, right in the skull cap, man. I think um one of us. Hello. Oh, it looks like it looks like that's it. Cool. Steel armor. Uh. Uh. What's in this? Uh. I guess we can um sell them at the trader since we we have enough room. Oh. I like having the hammer, but at the same time, I don't. It is very slow, but it does do a lot of damage. Oh, nice, some, some more meat. Meat is good. Oh, get a little readjustment going for the before we head out to loot the rest of everything, is there nothing up there? Everything looks good. Is there any secret hidden things? We're definitely going to get the easy cloth. Ooh, a nightstand. Oh, we already have the boots. All right. Um. Hmm. Nope, plastic. Yes, I will take that for sure. Would be nice to have found an axe, but hey, uh, <laughs> it's early, so we can't always get everything. I went through quickly. I really don't like looting ahead because you can get encumbered and then, you know, you're slower and that's not good. And this is a, to a bathtub you can loot. Don't know why there's a doorknob in the bathtub, but what was that? Oh, that's my arrow. No secret stashes or anything, huh? Maybe they'll have some food for us in the kitchen. Ooh, a microwave. Ah, oh, rotten flesh. Oh, I hope I don't have to eat the dog food, but I will if I have to. Coffee, coffee, coffee. That looks like it. Sweet. Um, let's have a look around because I've never been in this one. Okay, we got the empty trash pile. Let's go ahead and get this little tree. It looks stunted. Let's see if there's anything interesting around the outside. We already have a, we found that blueberry patch right off the bat. So yeah, there is nothing around. Except we, we found a working workbench. That's freaking awesome. Whew. Awesome. 
All right, so I guess, uh, oh no. What? What is the little umbrella? They added wetness? Oh my god. That is so cool and so terrifying at the same time because my house is on top of the building. So, um, I wonder if they added to like, uh, the trench coats that you can, you know, protect yourself from wetness. Does that make sense? Uh, I know it's like in one of the mods that I played with before, they, they added something like that. Uh, I don't know. Sometimes uh, it seems like it's a bit more of a bother. We might need to, well, I plan on, you know, we need the wood, so I plan, we might just go ahead and try to, I thought I was protected from the weather, or this is only heat, elemental protection, oh, it's only heat and cold that it's protected from. Okay, well, let's go drop this stuff off so we're not at, at least not encumbered. <laughs> that is interesting. Uh, definitely. <laughs> oh, I forgot to go over one. Uh, uh. Yeah, we got another egg. Oh, I meant to to keep that. All right, let's um let's go ahead and cook our little dude. And we got plenty of meat in case we run out of eggs, but hopefully we'll be able to have some eggs. That's the bad thing about the cold weather. See, I shouldn't be getting cold, but I think what it's doing is because you're, I'm wet, it's making the temperature colder than it should normally be, but I think I should still be protected from that at this particular moment with the heat buff, but I'm not being protected. So that's, that kind of stinks. Uh, but what, what are you gonna do, you know? All right, well, we got a few things to sell. We got these extra cowboy boots. Actually, oh, I got it to where you drop everything on death. Um, but we're, we're probably gonna sell the steel. Oh, and oh yeah, these steel crossbow bolts. Yeah. Uh, we probably need ammo for our gun as well. We can sell this. It's good. We got this battery bank. That's awesome. Um...
I'm I'm up at arms over <laughs> this hammer. It's good and bad. I don't like it that it's so slow. I like more of the fast weapons where I can maneuver around. I feel very restricted when I use the iron sledgehammer. I don't know. We can give it a go. We'll give it a go. We'll put it um we'll put our shiv over there. And we'll try it again. I know I did have fun with it. So maybe we'll still have fun with it. All right, I'm, I don't see we have like I need to put this down here. There we go. I guess we could sell this hunting rifle. Man, I'm just so the the traders don't reset like they did before. So I'm scared to sell some of some of these things at lower prices because they don't reset like they used to. So I'm not sure that I want to waste my chance at selling a rifle for this tier one that's only worth 44 coins. So yeah, let's just go run over and sell this. Which direction? Oh, I can't see. <laughs> yeah, that's the one with the saw and then the traders on the other side. Okay, so we're going at least the right direction. Um, I don't have that much money. They, We might need to buy a coat, uh, but I don't have anything to sell. Let's get this little tree. Yeah, I think that's whack. I think that's whack that... Uh, We're being affected by the cold. I think that's a bug, though. Um, it is cool that they added wetness, though. That is kind of cool. Also, um, these trees, uh, because you plant them on snow, they will only grow to 600. So I usually try and uh, plant as many of those as I can. So I have a ton of them lying around. At least until I can get uh, digging underground a little. And get some dirt to make, uh, to make a little tree farm. What about in here? Do we have anything? Oh yeah, we got tons left in here. Oh, we got some more of these. We can sell those. And let's go ahead and sell these. I know it's only 18, but... We can sell this little bit of brass. And let's go ahead and take this freaking ammo. There's so much of it. Take this ammo and carry it back to our chest. Beast and then Oh, and I want to get those blueberries back over there too, so I don't forget about those. I like punching those little bushes that get me wood for free. Well, it's not really free, but you know what I mean. I really need to... This wetness thing is... I, I need to, like, focus on getting, getting some my structure built so that I am protected from the weather. Now look, I'm inside. I should be protected. I should be protected from the wetness. It's not snowing in here. Okay, we're going to sell this. And 
these. Oh yeah, we need our shovel back. Uh, those. Are we doing okay? I don't think that's enough to buy a coat. Do they have a coat? Ah, uh, see, I'm a couple hundred short. Even that duster would be good. See, that's a 1621. That would be good for both hot and cold, which might be good for since there's desert and hot biomes nearby. But this one has way more cold resist, like nine more, but very little heat resist. So, but I can't afford, can't afford it. Even if I sell that, I can't afford it. Hmm, oh, those stack. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I don't know what Rats to do about that. Trap, <laughs> did did I not pick up a quest? Okay, this doesn't. You figure it would add something about the wetness. You're wet, which will make you colder. This may or may not be a good thing. I think it's bugged. Because I went inside and it did not go away. Uh. Mm. Go to the town and um, see if we can rifle through some some dressers to find some clothes. Uh, yeah, let's just go right across the road here. Whatever, whatever's right across the road. Already looted that. Where's this? I really like that they made that, um, Known that you can overeat without wasting the food. So that's pretty cool. Um, Alright, let's get. Let's go ahead and scrap those. You're not take me alive, Mr. Chin. <laughs> All right, um, let's see I look around. That's a really big, <sighs> that's a really big building. I don't want something that's going to, maybe we'll just do this loop guy right here gotta be on the lookout for the squawks.
Hello? <laughs> Alright, can't squeeze through there. A big mama get stuck on one of those before. Is that a dead one? Haha, <laughs> it's dead now. up on me. It looks like there's, oh, that, is that him? Yeah, that's him. All right. Let's hope this, uh, has some clothes in it. Uh, nothing that will really... Whoa! Alright, is there any little vultures over here? Only the dead ones. Those out. Okay, so it's gonna give us more than what we have, which is just two, two. Uh, technically, it's not giving us any more cold resist. Great. What about the hat? What I have on has plus eight cold resist. Okay, yeah, so we want to keep that, but we're going to keep this cowboy hat in case. Just in case. These are worth experience, too. Look at that. Let's see how much it's worth. Let's let it clear. Hundred and five experience for looting that vulture. That is pretty awesome. All right, let's get our shovel back. Actually, I want to go into the the trailer house. I guess. Oh, there's a car over there too. Also, is there anything? Let's go look. It looks like it's boarded up. 
Oh yeah, more. Well, hello. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, it's very powerful, but very slow. It's uh, it's good to have when you're outside and you have a lot of room to maneuver but when you're inside uh, not so much oh yes that should help with the cold some of it anyway Oh, a level two compound bow, but it's pretty jacked and we don't have any repair kits, so. Oh, goggles! Nerdy glasses, awesome. Oh, I love that. And you get a crafting tier on all the items that you craft. Oh, that is awesome. Did we get that? Yeah, we got the backpack. Oh, ho, 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 I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, that is so amazing. Um, I don't think we looked over at the car. What's in the car? Some arrows. Oh, I'm glad I looked over here. Well, maybe not so much. Okay, well, that was a. Uh, we got a hoodie and some nerdy glasses. That's definitely an improvement. Oh, in the trash. Um, I don't see that anything is hidden under the house. Oh, look, there's some pallets. I definitely, I want to try, oh! I didn't see the back. I didn't see. <gasps> yes! <laughs> Puffer coat! Oh, this was the awesome place to loot. I want to try looting this and see if we only get one wood. If it is, I'm not going to try it again. There's one. Yeah, see? I think you should totally get more than one wood from a pallet. But that's just me. So let's loot up uh, the rest of this concrete and cobblestone. Oh, look, there's my arrows. That's where my arrows were going. I wonder if there's anything. Oh, this is the entrance. It's worth more loot if you let them get destroyed like that. Oh, that was that was an awesome place to loot. <laughs> we got really lucky, got a puffer coat and a hoodie. That is awesome. Uh, so now, we're gonna go back, oh, is this, this is a horde, it looked like those guys were spawning right behind him, or, oh, 
I like it that I hit the guy behind him. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. It's good to have this when you're out wandering. And you have room to maneuver and back up and get away. But, oh yeah, look at that 10% experience bonus. Yes. That is amazing. I love those. I love the, the glasses. So what we got to do is we got to get back to our little um, house. Now that we know uh, weather is a thing as well as... Oh, let's get this little wood pile here. And hope we get some honey. Not that I've, se I've seen that it's very iffy if that um, works. I'm not as sh sure if that's a thing. We still didn't get any honey, so. I don't know what's going on. Maybe it just increases your chance to fight it off. It doesn't always work. But I don't know. All right, did we get anything to sell? I guess it's okay now. So we, it would be nice to get some of the mods that he has, but it's not necessary. Now we have our, our puffer coat and um, hoodie we should be not not cold at least in the normal situations so it should be okay for the most part <laughs> I can't say 100% that it's gonna be okay but I can't say that we have a good chance <laughs> we have a good chance of surviving um, did I put that chest on the back? I think I did. <laughs> Maybe we'll, we'll stop by and get some more stuff on our way. And we'll go ahead and eat. And drink. I don't think. Oh yeah, I'm doing really good. Some of this stuff should stack, so let's just try and get it all. Oh, we can't get everything. Okay. Um. Let's see, I think we can leave the broken glass and get the paper. Honestly. Um, yeah, and we're pretty much good. Now it's going to be <laughs> so slow. <laughs> so maybe uh, we'll go ahead and call the episode here. Because pretty much I'm going to get up top. Uh, empty out um, as best I can. And I'm going to start gathering and buying out a place to build to start the base I'll probably if I get enough time because I have stuff I could start it if I pick out the place and I think it would be beneficial to do it sooner rather than later because we're gonna need a roof over our head to protect us from the rain and uh, yeah because our weather protection is now gone. So, whew, yeah, it'll be close by the trader, as close as I can, um, whew, if I do start it, which I probably will, just so I can uh, do something during the night, because I don't like just sitting up there, and I don't have a good way 
of getting up and down safely <laughs> without getting munched on by zombies. <laughs> So I'd prefer to do my own base that way. I know, I know I can get in and out safely and easily if the zombies come knocking on my door. All right. Oh, so we're gonna go ahead and call the episode here. I'm gonna gather up some stuff. And possibly, and more than likely, start the base. I might leave my bed over here. But anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!